all right y'all so yeah i um i didn't want to make this video and i i was trying to wait to see what was going on what happened i was watching uh a live stream of trump's rally in pennsylvania and uh there was assassination attempt on his life that's what it looks like uh president trump was uh, tackled off a of stage by secret service um just very upsetting very 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 upsetting uh just you know I, this is where we are though you know i you know these these people are lunatics man i'm telling you um th th they will stop at nothing okay um i want to go ahead and show you exactly what what happened here and then i'll give you my comment on it all right Border Patrol, take a look at that. So that arrow is the lowest amount of illegal immigration ever in recorded history into our country. And then, and then the worst president in the history of our country took over. And look what happened to our country. Probably 20 million people. And you know, that's a little bit old, that chart. That chart's a couple of months old, and if you uh, want to really see something that's sad, take a look at what happened. Oh. There's a crowd up there looking. There were some people in the crowd up top there looking off until uh, the top, you know, it, it, you know, so, so it looks like it came from over there, basically, or over there. Crazy, man. This is where we are. They hate this man so much and they call him Hitler every chance they get. And they, this is what this is where this is how it uh, this is what we get from it, you know. I, I happen to go on to CNN, by the way. I just want to let you know this. I went on CNN to see if they were report. They actually reported on it. I was reading some of the comments, and and you you would be disgusted at the things that people were saying. I won't even repeat it. I won't even repeat it. But I reported several accounts uh, for hate speech, you know, and promoting terrorism. That's where we are right now, man. That's exactly where we are. This is absolutely crazy. Okay, we are watching live at a rally in Butler, Pennsylvania, where former President Trump was speaking on the stage. There has been some kind of disturbance that clearly sets law enforcement and Secret Service into motion, immediately jumping around the former president in a protective mode. The crowd has been screaming. They are standing by. You can hear some voices there saying, are we ready to go? Are we ready to go? We are looking at President Trump. This does not look good. I'm going to be honest with you from what we can see right here. It looks like they are attempting to move him out that he may have been injured. He is holding up his arm. He is pumping his fist, but clearly Secret Service wants to get him out of this situation. That's absolutely crazy, bro. Mm, mm, mm. That's what we're dealing with, though, man. The, the Democrats have absolutely nothing. All right. And they, they've stoked so much anger and violence in these people, man. And they radicalized them so much so that they try to take this man out, bro. Well, they, he's, he's definitely going to be the president now. All right. Now. All right. Our, our best success. Our best revenge is success. I'm so glad he's going to be actually be the president now. Thanks for giving us the election. We appreciate it. Thank you. All right. You know, the Democrats have nothing anyway. All right. Un un unbelievable. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. Man trying to set our country free. People actually hate him because of the media. Because the mainstream media has been lying about this man ever since he ran for president. So amazing that so many people loved this man before he ran for president. And just like a light switch was turned off, uh, so was the love for Donald Trump as soon as he decided to run for president. This man don't have to go through this, bro. He put himself through this. People in this country are so delusional. And I see these people all of the time. And trust me, the people that don't like Donald Trump, they have no idea what's going on. They have no idea. 
They're drunk, most of them. Most of them are on drugs and they're drunk. Okay? That's what I'm, t- that's what I'm telling you. Uh, you, you, don't t- you don't have sober-minded people. Uh, all, the, all the patriots that I met that love Trump, these people don't drink or smoke, bro. They don't do any drugs. They're just about their business, man. That's why Trump has so many uh, supporters. Donald Trump doesn't even drink. He doesn't smoke. I'm not saying the man is a saint. I'm not saying he's perfect. Neither are you and neither am I. But you got people in the comments at CNN saying, oh, darn, they missed. You know how many comments I saw in, in, on CNN uh, reporting on this? You know how many comments I saw like that? Too many to count. People saying it was staged. People saying all sorts of wicked things they were saying about this man. Not knowing what's going on. Just the evil. I just did a video the other day. I told you guys they were calling for his assassination out in the open. Out in the open. Okay. <sighs> guys, pray for President Trump. I've, I've been praying for him and his family. Uh, it's a dark day, bro. It's a real dark day, man. I, I you know, mm, I just I hope people understand what we're up against, and this is going to secure him the the election, man. Because if you're a Democrat and you're and you're watching this video, you need to snap out of it, bro. All right, one side is doing some wicked things here, okay? One side is doing some wicked things behind some things that they've hear on on the mainstream media. This ought to make the mainstream media stop talking bad about Trump like this, bro. It's it's awful. The things that they're saying about him are lies. Every last thing they're saying about Trump is a goddamn lie. And I'm tired of listening to it. I got to explain this stuff to my kids. And like, we're trying to run a business. We're trying to be successful. And I got to explain to my kids all the policies that he's for. And they're saying, why would they hate somebody like that? Because they've been radicalized by the mainstream media. And that's who's complicit. That's who's responsible for this. I hope the God that they catch the person that tried this attempt. I really do, man. But the mainstream media needs to start being held accountable for what they're doing. They're destroying this country with lies, trying to protect themselves from who knows what. But it's more to this story. We're going to get to the bottom of it. We're going to get to the bottom of it. We're going to keep our eyes peeled, guys. You stay safe. Uh, Keep praying. Keep President Trump in your prayers and his entire organization, his family. Uh, And we're going to take this election. We're going to take our country back, man. We're, we're going to get this election done. It's a sealed. It's a sealed. It's a, this, this deal is sealed, bro. Trump 2024.